Hi guys, so today I'm doing this glam kind of witch Halloween makeup, so let's just get straight into it. I'm going to start off with my Master Conceal Concealer, and I'm going to put this all over my eyelids as an eyeshadow base. I'm then going to set that concealer down with a pressed powder. I'm just using my Maybelline Fit Me powder. This would just help the eyeshadows go on a lot smoother. And today for the eyeshadow, I'm going to use a few of the City Mini palettes. I'm going to start off with this kind of light purpley shade as a transition color. I'm just going to buff this into the crease and just blend it up quite high to the brow bone. I want this look to be really smoky. And now I'm going to take the deeper purple just to kind of darken the look up. So I'm going to put this in the crease and just blend it a little bit lower just so it blends up nicer into the lighter purple. I'm going to grab another palette now and take that kind of violet dark purple. And this is when I'm going to really darken up the look. So again, I'm putting it in the crease in the outer corner. And I'm also going to grab the other purple in the palette, which is lighter. And I'm going to put this in between just so it's quite vibrant, but also blends out quite nicely. I'm going back in with my Master Conceal Concealer. I'm just creating a base for my lid shade. So I'm putting that down and just kind of patting it out so it blends out nicely. I also ended up fixing the inner and outer corners just a little bit with that dark violet purple to make it more of a halo eye. And then I'm taking this really vibrant blue shade and just packing that on with my finger. So I decided I wanted to do some wing liner because the look is quite dramatic, so I thought why not? So I'm just using my Hyper Sharp Liquid Liner. I'm now going to curl my lashes just to prep them for mascara. And the mascara I'm using today is the Big Shot Mascara. This is one of my favorites because it is a drier formula. It holds my lashes up really, really well. I ended up going in with some pretty dramatic falsies just because Halloween, why not? Go for it. So this is the eye look done for now, but we're going to move on to the face. I'm going to use the Pore Minimizing Master Prime Primer, and I'm going to focus this on the T-zone area, just where I've got quite large pores and little lines. I feel like it really fills it in well. And I'm going to use my Super Stay Foundation. I believe I was using sand and then it was a little bit light, so I ended up mixing in warm honey just to kind of get my perfect shade. So I'm just blending that out with a sponge. For concealer, I ended up using my Fit Me Concealer. I did feel like this was a little bit too light for me, so I ended up grabbing my Master Conceal and just mixing that in to make it a little bit darker. So I'm just putting that under the eyes, on the chin, and on the forehead. I'm going back in with my Fit Me powder again in 120, and I'm going to just set the highlighted places on my face, so just underneath my eyes, kind of around my mouth, on my chin, and on my forehead. And to set everywhere else on my face, I just used my Super Stay powder because it was a little bit deeper in color. I'm now just going to warm up and sculpt my face with my Master Contour palette. So just again, around my cheeks and around my forehead. I'm now going to take my blush palette and take the deepest kind of purpley shade. And I'm applying a bit more blush than I normally would just because I wanted this to be quite dramatic. It actually turned out pretty nice to be honest. And now I'm taking my Master Holographic Highlighter. I've been wanting to use this for a while, so I thought why not use it today? I'm just putting this on my cheekbones and on my Cupid's bow. So now I'm going back to the eyes and I'm going back in with that light kind of mauvey purple and I'm just going to smoke out the lower lash line. I'm also taking the deeper purple just to make it a bit darker. I'm going to smoke this out more than I normally would just because I want this to be quite dramatic. I'm going to finish off with my Big Shot Mascara and I'm also going to use a Kajal eyeliner pencil and just put this in my waterline. 
So for lips today, I'm going to use two of the Superstay Matte Ink Lips. And the one I'm starting off with is Huntress, which is more of a gray. And then after I've put that on the outside, I'm going to use Visionary on the center of my lips, kind of to do like an ombre lip. And I wanted this to kind of almost match the eyes. So this is the whole look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the Maybelline channel. And I'll see you guys really soon in my next video. Bye.